Science Beetle. Hey, uh, welcome back students. What we want to go ahead and do today is actually just focus on seeing if we can calculate a percent composition. So for this uh, lesson, we're going to go ahead and focus on that. And let's just go ahead and get started. I've got a problem already set up for us. We're just going to do a very simple one. Uh, the very example, simple example we've got here is we're just going to, we're going to go ahead and try to find the percent composition of barium in this particular compound here. So we want to find the percent composition for barium. Right. So we, what, what we have to do here is we have to go ahead and look at all the atoms. And so the different types of atoms that we've got available to us here is that we've got a Ba atom and we've got a fluorine. The Ba atom is going to have a mass of approximately 137.33. Okay. And fluorine is going to have a mass of 18.998. And these are both in grams. And we know that we've got one barium atom, and so we see that here. And we've got two fluorine atoms, and those fluorine atoms are there. And so what we've got to do here is now just go ahead and rewrite this, and let's go ahead and estimate our masses to make things a little bit easier for us. So this 137.33 actually becomes 137 grams. We're going to multiply that times 1, and the fluorine gets turned into 19 grams, and we're going to multiply that times 2. When we do that, our respective numbers here are going to be 137 grams for the barium, and for the fluorine, we're going to get 38 grams. We go ahead and add these together, these two at the very end. And when we do that, we get 175 grams. And this is going to be the total mass. Okay. At this point, what we got to do is we take the amount for barium that we're interested in. One mistake that many students do is they only take the mass of the one. But keep in mind that we need to take the, bar the mass of all of the different bariums. In this particular case, we only have one, so our total mass is going to be 137 grams for barium. So the percent barium in this particular problem is going to be equal to the 137 grams divided by the total mass of 175 grams times 100. Remember, the grams cancel, and in this particular case, we get 137 divided by 175, which will give us a decimal of 0.782 multiply that by 100 and we end up with a percentage of 78.3 percent barium. And this here is your answer. So hopefully that was helpful. Go ahead and um, take a look at these problems and if you have any other questions go ahead and subscribe and we'll talk to you soon.